cow, what in the world are you doing? What do you mean? It's just for dramatics, for the YouTube. I was like, you're, you're ruining the seed hoppers. This gimbal, bear with me. Oh, here we go. For real, what, what are you doing? I'm putting this extension on. Yep, putting some seed hopper extensions. There we go. Hello, everybody. All right, so I've got this fancy gimbal, trying it out. We are working on our peanut planter because before you know it, we'll be planting peanuts. We had a couple hoppers that were just wrecked, been cracked uh, for a couple years now. So we got one that's bad, we're replacing it. That's what Kyle's working on. But I wanna show you guys our farm office. So every morning we go in the office, we meet at seven o'clock, talk about the day, what we're gonna get into. But we jazzed it up this year. We got new floors, me and Kyle painted it. it looks so good. Let's go in there and I'll, I'll show you all of our hard work. And flip this around, press twice, boop, boop. Yeah. Still trying to figure it out. What do you think of my new gimbal, Jeff? Yeah, I've, I, hey, well, eat, watch this. Whoop. Mm. Nice. Yeah, I'm still figuring it out. That's pretty cool. It is cool. Steady. Steady. All right, guys, here it is. Check out how good this office looks. Oh, wait. I'm not going to show you quite yet. Let's jump in the time machine to two days ago when me and Kyle started on this and then you'll kind of see the progress of it and see what it looks like. Hello everyone. Today, me and Kyle are painting the room. Well, we've already painted it. This whole office used to be blue. As you can tell now, it is a beautiful shade of cotton white. Kyle, how do you think we did? I think we did great. I think we did really good. Looks good. I don't see any blue. We got a couple touch-ups here and there, but for the most part, uh, looks great. We didn't get any paint on the new floors. So we're really jazzing it up, all for Randy, for his uh, Let's Get Nut show on Acres TV. Look at that precision. Kyle did a great job taping. Uh-oh. It'll be all right. We can get it up. Cotton white. We do have a little bit of an issue up there. It's possibly some black mold, but we're just gonna paint over it. We've also got a little bit right there. You can tell the office is a complete disaster. We've got stuff everywhere. Give you an update here in a minute when we get everything put back together. We got new blinds. We're gonna paint the shelves. It's gonna look incredible. Look about right. Looks great. Oh, that's one of them floppy hats. Can't even see it. Floppy, make floppier. Oh, that's a good one. Got a little sweat stains on that one. Oh, I remember that one. I like that one a lot. <laughs> okay, guys, we are coming right along the office. We got it all painted. We got the shelves back in. We're getting all the Field Rose hats back on display. And if you want a Field Rose hat, we've got them for sale. Farmfocus.com, check them out. Wait, this would be a good time to mention they're having a sale. So if you do want a Phil Rose hat like this one, or we've got sweatshirts, stickers, uh, shirts, pleather of different items, you can use the code LOVEAG at checkout and you get 15% off your entire order. And you get a free Valentine's Day card while supplies last. So it lasts until uh, February 14th. So if you want to get your uh, girlfriend, boyfriend, wife, whatever, if you want to get them a Field Rose hat or shirt, sweatshirt, sticker, uh, Randy CD, the debut album, tie-dye t-shirt, all that is there. Oh, all that is there. So head over to farmfocus.com. Use the code LOVEAG at checkout and get you something. All right, let's head back. Hats, and we also have shirts like, like this one. one. I work for peanuts and uh, sweatshirts, you name it, a bunch of other items. So check them out, farmfocus.com. Kyle, have you ever been to farmfocus.com? Yes, I have. Was that a yes? It's a great website. What did you buy when you went there? Uh, a hat. I got a feeling you've never been there. I've been there. You, and you bought a Field Rose hat. Field Rose hat, yeah. But I give you all the Field Rose hats you want. 
Well, you was out. Oh. But I couldn't wait. I got you. I got you. Yeah, we can trash that. It's a 2020. I really don't think we need to keep that one. That's the newest one. That's 2023. That's gone. 2022 over. 2021. Yeah, we can chunk all those. Jeff Rowe, it's like you're getting dirty. What you working on? Uh, gooseneck trailer jack. Gooseneck trailer jack. What's wrong with it? Uh, the gears need to be shimmed. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'm grabbing anymore. I had to use telehandler yesterday to hook it up. Kyle had to at the same time the other day. So, here we just go ahead and fix it. We still have a utter disaster here on the desk. We're, we'll get all that situated. Uh, a little bit more of it is that this is all of my camera stuff, which I need to uh, do a much better job of uh, organizing that. That's just kind of all thrown in there, but uh, it's coming along nicely. Short story on this. I bought this for dad in Vermont uh, when I was 18, right out of high school. Uh, me and a buddy went to Vermont on a road trip and I uh, bought that a, um, bought that at a uh, yard sale. 1847. Oh, we got the toys. All right, we got a 40, 4320. We got a 4230, but we don't have a 4320. These are all tractors that dad has collected through the years. We got a 3020. We actually do have a 3020. Nice. What else we got? Oh, that looks like an old one. Some... What is that? It doesn't say. That's just a John Deere tractor, I guess. Huh. That's a 4450. 4450, yep, we got one of those. Oh, a little spider whip there. And there's the John Deere tractor. I don't know what it is. But what else we got? 4230. We do have one of those. Is that a 630 disc? Looks like it. I don't know. We'll say it is. We got a 630. Oh, we got a gap there. Oh, this will fill the gap. Perfect. A Thunder Creek water bottle. I had a change of plans. I was uh, redoing the desk here and uh, Randy has an illuminated LED strip. But then I started thinking, hey, it would look cool to put that along the shelves. So we took all the toys off that we just put back on. We got the LED light strip that runs along here now. And now we're going to uh, put all the toys back on. Going to, going to. Without the blinds, I can spy on the guys. There's Jeff washing his hands. Looks like he got the gooseneck trailer fixed. All right, so we got everything back in place. Looking good. My nephew Hunter, he's the IT guru around here. Uh, he's gonna mount all the internet stuff. It's gonna go there by that beautiful painting uh, by Atlan, my oldest, when she was maybe six. It's a heart, if you can't tell. And yeah, this is it. Turned out great. Uh, right here will be a huge Let's Get Nuts sign for Randy's show that he does on Acres TV. And there'll be a TV in that corner that will rotate sponsors. Um, and I've got all my camera gears, all kind of GoPros, 11s, 9s, 8s, more camera gear. Hey, Jeff. Hi. Come on in. What's up? Get her fixed? Yes. Sweet. There's the bathroom, we'll show you that in a minute, or maybe later, depending what Jeff's doing in there. GoPros, GoPros. Got all my GoPro chargers and camera chargers. This is the new uh, Sony camera charger. Old JVC uh, camera, camcorder back in the day. 
Uh, what else? We got the two Canon M50s, a bunch of other random mounts, microphones, suction cups, media mods, all kind of stuff. Uh, this is where Keithy sits in the morning. Jeff sits right here. And then we have Kyle right here. Dad's right there. And I'm right there. So this is what it looks like. Tomorrow we will get the blinds on and uh, should be looking pretty spiffy. spiffy. There we go again, I can't talk. And an old gold kiss sign. Pretty cool. Hey, hey Dad. You hey, what's going on? What you think? Oh man, y'all got it all done in one day? Uh, well, two days. We started on it yesterday, ran out of paint, and finished it today. Yeah, that looks real good. Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh -huh. Them baseboards could be touched up. Yeah, yeah, they a little... Good rainy day one day when nothing's going on. Mm-hmm. Wait a minute. What? They stains all in the city. Yeah, it's an old ceiling. You built this thing back in, what, mid-90s? Uh, matter of fact, it was 92 or 93. 92, so yeah, it's yeah. a lot of years. Yeah, it was quite a few. Well, we could either clean it or we could paint it. I would paint it. No, how are you going to clean it? Rag, water. Rag, water, yeah. We've got all them little cracks in it, you know. Yeah. Get your little roller and just we hold it out like this. Don't do it like that. Yeah. You it wouldn't take long. I mean, we'd have to. Just stick on it? Yeah. Yeah. And cover the whole thing in plastic. Mm hmm. Yeah. You just move your stuff to the middle. Yeah. Yeah, it won't be, be bad. Tell How us. Will it, uh, will it, will it, get that number. Oh, lines. Oh, I got, hey, right here. And I started oh. to put them together, but uh -huh. it had about eight sheets of instructions. Yeah. So I was like, hey, Keefe's very mechanical. He could yeah. probably put them up in no time. He probably didn't need them. Uh-huh. Instructions. But yeah, I've got new blinds. But yeah, if we paint the ceiling, we'll look great. Yeah. Baseboards. New floor. Man, new flooring. Uh-huh. The floor looks great. Tell us an interesting story about the desk. Desk come from the... Peanut mill, old peanut mill mm -hmm. in Malone, in the old wood office and all. And when Daddy and them built across the road, I think it come out here. Yep. Then, or before, probably before then. Yeah. It's an old uh, desk. It's been there since I can pretty much remember it being an office here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it weighs about 80 to 100 pounds. Oh yeah, it's, big, it's heavy, it's heavy built. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey, I got a question for you. Do you know where this came from? Where did you get this? The John Deere seat there. Uh huh. We was at Webster, Florida, mm -hmm. at the big flea market. They have a huge flea market down there. Mm -hmm. Especially real good in the winter because all the northerners come down, bring stuff to sell. And that's where I spotted that John Deere seat. And I can get what it was. It wasn't a whole lot. I said that was just be something neat to have. Yeah. So I picked it up and brought it home and we hung it on the wall. That's a good story, but that's not true. Oh, what is it? No, no, no. I bought that in Vermont. When Vermont. me and Danny went to Vermont, uh -huh. I bought that and brought it back to you as a gift. Sure. I'm one hundred percent positive. I'm not sure about a lot of things, but no doubt I bought that from Vermont. But the Webster story is pretty nice. I mean, I bought a lot of stuff. You know? <laughs> I mean, I can't keep details on everything. Yeah, yeah. Honest mistake. Yeah, we went down there for years. Yep. Especially when we was um, racing mm -hmm. and motorcycles and that. Or, yeah. But you didn't get that there. I bought you that. Oh, uh, where did you get this from? That we found at the the feed store that you mm -hmm. own. Mm -hmm. Uh, just in the back. I don't. We don't really. There's not a date on it. It's an old gold gold kiss gold sign, kiss, and it's the pounds of seed and peanuts right there runners what's it saying 36 to 30 30 36 inch rows 100 pounds 80 to 100 pounds 80 to 100 pounds wow per acre they miss that now don't they yeah we're a little higher than that about 155 yeah uh-huh yeah okay. well i think that's All you a, need is your real nice john deere clock to make sure See, they make them every day. Maybe I'll get you one. Yeah, that'd be nice to do. <laughs> and we're back. Hope you guys enjoyed the office tour. I'm really upset Dad forgot about that amazing gift that I got him. But it is what it is. But yeah, like I said at the start of the video, we are working on our peanut planner. Last year I did a video at the end of peanut season asking you guys to remind me of all the stuff that we need to do for this peanut planner. 
No one has reminded me yet. Still pretty early. But uh, go back, watch that video. I kind of remember most of the stuff. We're going to replace the fans on the back one. Is, uh, is messed up, so we're replacing it. Hoppers. Um, that's really bad. It really didn't need a whole lot of stuff. For it to be a, what, 25-year-old planter, it's actually in uh, pretty good shape. What we got in there? 35. 35. We are also getting our breaking plows ready to roll. We've got two of them. We've got a seven plow on land, and then we've got this one, which is a five that runs in the fur. So you kind of sit sideways as you're breaking land. Okay, everybody, the day is coming to an end for us, but I do want to show you this inside the office. I got the blinds hung up. Check it out. Keefe. How's it going? Tired. Tired. What you think about them blinds? You hung them all by yourself? Yep, all by myself. I'm impressed. They look good. I read just a little bit of the instructions and then, um, actually, yeah, got them on. They're actually level. Mm-hmm, yep. Got that one. It's got the fancy little thing where you can adjust how much light you want to come through. That's going to be nice so the sun won't be hitting me in the face in the morning. Yep. Kyle, what you think about those blinds? They look good, don't they? Mm -hmm. Keefe, what'd you do today? Uh, I was supposed to get y'all some video today, but it didn't happen. I sprayed, cleaned out the sprayer, fixed the tire, fixed the new valve stem well in it. Pretty good Friday. Mm -hmm. Kyle, what'd you do today? Uh, I transported some pallets. Mm -hmm. uh, I washed the 49. Yep. I think that's about it. I feel like there was other... Uh, the hopper? Mm, I fixed the hopper. Hopper, yep. Yeah. Apparently I fixed the wrong one though. Nah, hey, it was cracked. Either way, both of them need to be changed. Good job. All right, team. What'd you do today? Uh, I did a lot. <laughs> I filmed a little bit. I uh, hung two blinds um, and filmed a little bit. Hey, I, 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 I picked you up at I Jeff's, you and brought you back. I appreciate yeah. it. Me and Ty, oh, we're, we're remembering all kind of stuff. Me and you took the tires off the Zuzu generator this morning. Yeah, yeah. Manually, we had an air jack, but we did it manually. Mm. And uh, lug wrench. We didn't use any power tools. Yep. Yeah. 